Hello, hello, welcome back today. I will be watching Batman from 1989. And sometimes I wake up and I have this clear idea of what movie I'm gonna watch that day. And then you have days like today where I'm feeling a bit under the weather and I just want to like scroll and decide on a whim which one I want to watch the most. And I was actually looking at Tim Burton movies. I recently watched Mars Attacks, which was very fun. I also watched Beetlejuice and I find him a very interesting producer. So I was looking at what he all made and I stumbled upon Batman and I kind of don't get it because Tim Burton makes interesting, ridiculous movies and Batman is quite a serious one. So it piqued my interest and I really want to watch it now. And I watched the Batman trilogy from Nolan, which I absolutely adored. I also watched the, the newest Batman with uh, Robert Pattinson. And so now I feel like I'm going back but I want to spark a conversation with this one because I feel like DC is a big blank page in my mind, like a puzzle that I cannot really fill in just yet. Is there a timeline that I need to follow? Am I completely going wrong with watching this one right now? Hopefully not. Like, tell me what to watch in what order. If there's also like really bad ones that everybody wants me to skip, type out those essays in the comments because I do read them and they help me out a lot because I have nobody to talk to about this. <laughs> And so I really want to know how I tackle DC. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, the full length reaction, plus also the edited versions you can find over on Patreon ahead of time when they arrive here. That was not really good English, but I'm not a native speaker. So, well, you get it, right? So edited versions are also going to come to Patreon and they will be posted earlier than on here. So if you want to watch next movies that I've done already or shows a little bit ahead of when they arrive on YouTube, Patreon now is providing that. What a ramble. I just took a painkiller, so I feel like I have this flickering of energy. Let's get going. <laughs> I love strong orchestra music. Prince? Gotham City, welcome back. I'm sorry, this is my gallery. No, listen, I was here first. Oh, that would make me mad. <laughs> See, I'm just not made for a city life. For God's sake, Harold, can we please just get a taxi? This is so painful, the, this fight, family dynamic. That is like this loser guy just trying his best. Hey, mister, give me a dollar. Are you deaf? You don't speak English? <laughs> <laughs> hey lady, do the kid a favor. Full scream. Ah! I was thinking like this looks eerily like Batman's backstory, you know? Family and a boy coming out of a show getting robbed, murdered. Johnny Gobbs got ripped and took a walk off a roof. Hey. I heard the bat got him. There ain't no bat. He's gonna be proven wrong very quickly. Now shut up. Ooh. <laughs> oh boy! You pissed him off. <laughs> Where are you going? I want you to tell all your friends about me. What are you? I'm Batman. So cool. Wasn't Batman the one that didn't actually kill people? Hopefully he learned his lesson. As mayor, I promise to root out the source of this corruption. It's always interesting to see a movie where basis of the story is the same, but all the characters are different actors. There we have him. All work and no play makes Johnny a dull boy. Is that it? This clown could touch Grissom. I'd have handed him his lungs by now. If Grissom knew about us, he might hand you something. <laughs> you don't worry about anything, do you, Jack? Must it be weird that your character in the movie is the same first name as your own? You look fine. I didn't ask. Oh, yeah, he's, he's not that into you. <laughs> Let me guess. Giant menacing supernatural form. Kind of like a bat. Are we still not believing? Sorry, Knox. These two slipped on a banana peel. Let me as a voice, I can not wake up next to him, I think. Don't be writing this stuff in your newspaper, Knox. It'll ruin your already useless reputation. <laughs> they say he drinks blood. They say... I say you're full of shit, Knox. <gasps> and if so, is he on the police payroll? And if so, what's he pulling down? After taxes. 
Is there a job opening for this role, please? <laughs> I'm really wondering what his role is gonna be in all of this. You an A1 nut boy. Grissom knows it. Damn, he's got some friends. <laughs> <laughs> Where you've been spending your nights. Ooh, I know. It's not like you can do anything about it. Knox, Knox, I got something for you. <laughs> He'll be laughing lost. Hello, legs. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, listen, listen, if you want me to pose nude, you're gonna need a long lens. <laughs> That's a good one. I'm here to see some of the wildlife in Gotham City. I like bats. Yeah, I eat bats in my dorm room and I don't like bats. I don't seem to be on the guest list. Fixed. <laughs> Vale, will you marry me? Nope. Will you buy me lunch? Maybe. I eat light. I like this dynamic. <laughs> I say we break into the place and make off with the records and say it was industrial espionage. Damn. The Joker? Okay. Damn, screwing your boss's girl is like dangerous territory. I guess that's maybe why he likes it. It's an important job. I need someone I can trust. So someone else. <laughs> Don't forget. Your lucky deck. Wow, you really messed up his cards that way. Your luck is about to change. Is he on to him? Get me Lieutenant Eckhart. He's setting him up. It's so sad. It's a charity to give a party. <laughs> a party to give a party. Good evening, man. A little crowded. Taylor Swift just walked into the room. Could you tell me which of these guys is Bruce Wayne? Well, I'm not sure. Is that gonna be him? <laughs> <laughs> that guy deserves more tips, yes. <laughs> oh, oh, poor fellow. He's probably like the youth has no respect anymore. Isn't anybody gonna go on record? Uh, Your Honor, great suit. No comment. I'd be really annoyed though if you go to a party and then someone is like, speak on business. Speak, speak on, the, on the record. Probably doesn't get chicks. They like him for his big charity balls. Yes, doesn't anybody love charity balls? Oh, he's right there. It's just so awkward. Oh, sorry. Bruce Wayne. Oh, so painful. Alexander Knox. His name is Alexander. Like my boy. Yeah, you've got a wonderful eye. Yeah, some people think she has two. <laughs> Uh, I I think perhaps this way, sir. So. Oh. That's our Alfred. Oh, and uh, give Knox a grant. Oh, oh, oh. He got his grants. The rich. You know why they're so odd? Because they can afford to be. It's kind of true. Damn. It must be weird to have, like, know what people are saying behind your back. I think it might be easier not to know. Them in suits. Is it that easy to open a vault? Freeze! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Damn, he's wreaking havoc. Is that the word? <gasps> uh, is this really dangerous? Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> You're just really embarrassing yourself. That's it. Now they've seen him, though. It's gonna change their tune. Uh oh. oh. Hesitated too long, dude. Bonk. Jesus. Oh, me. That guy again. He is very lucky with his bodyguard. He should get a raise. Come on! Come on, Jack! Heck. On me. Think about the future. <gasps> oh, he pissed off the wrong guy. Oh, and that Jack Nicholson smile.
How he's like, oh, oh, oh. Who is this guy? I don't know. If you're in the force, that must worry you because so far, so good. But also, you don't control this guy, so that must be scary. Wait, 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 wait. If there's no, if there's no bat, then who dropped this guy Napier into the ass? Suicide! Sure. Oh, I got a date. Bruce Wayne. He's a rich stiff, but you can do much better. Thanks for being so concerned. Bye. Poor guy. A bit bad for him. He could do much better. Like me. Ooh, she has that 80s hair. Could you pass the salt? Sure. What a gentleman. For a second, I thought he was going to call Alfred to pass the salt. <laughs> Do you like eating in here? You want to know the truth? I don't think I've ever been in this room before. Oh my God. <laughs> Do you want to get out of here? Yes. He's taking the soup. That was the first and last time I gave him a riding lesson. I love this, the vibe with Alfred eating together. That he's not like this rich brick above everyone else. No, he just wants to hang out with Alfred. <laughs> you know, this house and all this stuff really doesn't seem like you at all. Some of it is very much me. Have I seen that actor before? Because I don't recognize him. But I feel like if he played in such a big movie, then I don't know, there must be other stuff. Oh, do we have our Joker? Mirror. I don't think you want to do that, sir. Is it a face only a mother could love or not even? <laughs> oh, that gives me the creeps. I feel a little drunk. And you're not anything. Hey, one drink and I'm flying. <laughs> Why are you afraid of flying? Damn. I wish I was at Ford. <laughs> Whoa, yes. Then Britain doesn't let us wait. Poor Alex. <laughs> Uh oh, you're dead man walking. That you, sugar bumps? This lighting is so cool with the silhouette. Set me up over a woman. A woman! Hope she was worth it on both sides. You can call me Joker. Oh, what? Oh. I never knew he was a Joker. What a surprise. Eh, what a day. <laughs> Damn. Honestly, he's making the best of it. And he's still smiling. Cannot not, so... <laughs> it is a whole new month and a whole lot of things are changing. So, from now on, you can not only find the full-length reactions on Patreon, like two days in advance. No, you can also find the edited versions on Patreon and everything full-length and edited two weeks in advance of YouTube. So if you've been watching along on Patreon, you noticed with Arcane that everything already appeared on Patreon as well and edited too. And now we're gonna start the same thing with Sopranos and with Stranger Things. So if you go to Patreon right now, you already see episodes that are not on here yet and everything will be two weeks ahead with Sopranos and Stranger Things edited and full length. We're gonna do the same thing with movies, but it takes a little while to get ahead as much because they just take longer editing time. Yeah, soon as well, everything movie-wise will be edited on Patreon two weeks ahead as well. As always, we also have some nice exclusives. The Wire season two, we start on Patreon exclusively and also The Pacific, which is a show that blew me away. So yeah, that one is on Patreon as well. If you would love to watch that with me, I was just blown away by it thank you so much if you join patreon if you consider joining i know that it's not the most fun thing to promote but honestly i really need it to pay for editors lately you guys might have followed it a bit copyright on youtube has been a mess on march almost all my videos got blocked or copyright claimed and we're working hard to work with that but i do need patreon if i want to keep working with editors and i need to because i don't have time to edit my own videos because i work still and i have a baby and so i don't have time <laughs> so yeah patreon actually at this point keeps the channel going so thank you for considering joining there and if you don't that's totally fine too but thank you just for understanding that it's existing and that's why i do this little clip in the middle of the video but i'm not gonna stop you any longer let's go back to the reaction wait till they get a load of me mm. Mm. <laughs> oh. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Damn, immediate day the next day or something's wrong. Mm, bye. Come on. Aww. Damn, dude, how are you gonna do your day life, your night life, and a lady? Well, 
I'll talk to you guys when you get back. Miss Vale, we're going to be here for quite a while. Alfred! You blew his cover. You'll never believe what happened to me today. That's a good coping skill. I don't want to be confronted with this situation. If we can't do business, why? We'll just shake hands and that'll be it. I have a hard time looking at him right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow, anyone else has an opinion? Antoine got a little hot under the collar. <laughs> You're crazy. Yeah. <laughs> now get out of here! Oh, that's so interesting. Almost like the skin color is fake, but the white underneath is the real thing. Your pals. Uh... Are you still there? Of course. Maybe we uh, ought to give him a couple of days to think it over. I think they quite made up their mind though, wouldn't we? I actually think that playing Joker is a really hard role because you really need to kind of pay us of that like craziness and like, oh, it works, it works. Girl, that's a bit intense, isn't it? After one date, I know you spend the night still. Damn, that's. I don't know. I've never followed a guy like this, so I find that a bit too much. <laughs> Where his parents died. It's good to have a bit of that backstory, I guess. Suddenly, so all clowns scary. Is he a mime? It is legitimate. Uh oh. Hello, Vinny. It's your uncle Bingo. Time to pay the check. Bruce doesn't give a damn. Ugh, so many confusing things going on at the same time. The festival opens. The police are going to stop these guys. <laughs> this guy thinks that everybody like wants to go to a party when people are being killed on the street. I don't have any comments now. Okay. Can somebody tell me what kind of a world we live in where a man dressed up as a bat gets all of my press? Bat clown, bat clown. Miss Vale telephone. Alfred, why don't you marry her? <laughs> I can't go on with that right now. If not now, when? Look at him caring for his heart. She is great, isn't she? Yes, sir. Don't let her slip away. Bad tie. No style. <laughs> She's dating some guy named Wayne. She's about to trade up. I don't know, man. I'm of a mind to make some mookie. <laughs> oh, that hurts. <laughs> What's he been doing with all the cutouts, though? Like, why is he doing that? Or is there not a reason because he's just crazy? The fashion world was stunned today by the sudden deaths of models Candy Walker and Amanda Keeler. Cause of death has been attributed to a violent allergic reaction. At the same time? Three mysterious deaths at a beauty parlor in... <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Barry, what the hell's going on? Somebody just lost their job. <laughs> is she gonna die like this? New and improved Joker products! Oh no. That's why they were all smiling earlier. That luscious tan. Those ruby lips and hair color. So natural. Only your undertaker knows for sure. <laughs> oh god. Where can I get these fine new items? Nobody's saying that. Chances are you bought them already. <laughs> Love that Joker. So it's in stuff already, so a lot of people are gonna die now. Alfred, let's go shopping. Yes, sir. Alfred's always ready for anything. The search goes on through Gotham's shopping nightmare. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm gonna be 10 minutes late to the museum, okay? I'll see you when I get there. Bye. Imagine having to call for everything and then hoping that they get the message or pick up. Okay, fine. Thank you. Wait a minute, Alfred. I'm not meeting her today. <gasps> He set up a date? Oh no. Huh? Was it a trick? For a second I thought it was Alfred. Miss Vale, this just arrived for you. Is there a sorry I didn't make it gift?
Oh no. And it works quick. Holy hell. Let's broaden our minds. Lawrence. It's my husband's name. We have a Lawrence. We have an Alexander. Where's the Marys? <laughs> Oh man, I don't like that. Destroying art. Oh boy. Imagine how much time they spent making that and how quickly it is ruined. <laughs> Must be fun to record though. I'd also be like... <laughs> She's still just sitting there waiting. I'd be running out the door. I'm meeting someone who wants to see my work. Crap. Crap. Nobody asked your opinion. Now that's good work. Dark. I am the world's first fully functioning homicidal artist. What do you want? That's a good question. My face on the one dollar bill. You must be joking. Oh boy. Do I look like I'm joking? <laughs> it's a confusing question. You said I could watch you improve the paintings. Why is she wearing a mask? Oh no. She is a living work of art. <laughs> Poor woman. Tell me, uh, what do you know about? I don't know anything about Batman. What do you know about? Well, how about a little you and me? Hmm? How about no? You're insane. I thought I was a Pisces. I have a little. I don't know how much Pisces, so. Boy. Oh! Damn, this is stuff for nightmares. Um, whoop. Hold on. It wouldn't have to tell me twice. A scream. Get in the car. Which one? Well, I would know which one to pick, I guess. No, I want the purple green one in the back. They have multiples. What? Damn, their marketing is on point. And that's how you take a left. <laughs> Not very convenient to get in. <laughs> she has a good movie scream. See the thing on my belt? Grab it. Whatever you do, don't let go. Whoa! Whoa! Some kind of body armor. He's human after all. What were you thinking? It was an actual mega bet? No. Sure! Woo! Whoa, now the question is, is it on her camera or not? Yeah. That was a cool chump. Oh, he has a good swing. <laughs> Come here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Ah! You weigh a little more than 108. Oh, really? Let's go. <laughs> you know, of all moments to lie about your weight, I wouldn't pick that one. You'd wonder, though, if they slept together, have been so close together, if you would not recognize his voice or features that close up. Then I'd be like, holding on. <laughs> She's just like chilling, looking mysterious. Oh! Be careful. Dude! This whole bat cave concept is so cool. The Joker's tainted hundreds of chemicals at the source. Don't look at me. <laughs> He's psychotic. Some people say the same thing about you. Ooh. You're not exactly. Normal. Uh, a lot of people are not normal. It doesn't mean they're psychotic. There is something else you have that I want. Perfect China. Mary. Oh, I took the film. Ah! I was like, did he take your bra or what? What was that? <laughs> I have given a name to my pain. A mysterious figure. And it is Batman. And disappear at <gasps> oh my god. A lot of televisions are being destroyed here. She is quite tenacious. You're right about that. Perhaps you could try telling her the truth. 
Ooh, Alfred's harsh truths. Hi. But roses on the ground, and I get this. <laughs> you invited me out. We went to dinner. I thought we right. felt something. Well, and I you trusted you, and I even slept with you. I can't believe I did well, that. And then you I... wouldn't return my phone calls. You must be some kind of jerk. <laughs> You're a real nice girl, and I like you a lot. But for right now, shut up. Whoa, boy. I have something I have to tell you. Here we go. Oh my God, you're married. <laughs> no, <I'm not> married. <laughs> that makes sense. Just spill it. I am Batman. And then she can giggle a little bit and then we can go back to serious. <laughs> you know how a normal person gets up, goes downstairs and eats breakfast. And... Dude, just get to the point. You know. No. <laughs> Good try. Vicky, what I'm trying to tell you is. I'm trying to tell you that I'm a superhero. It's okay. You can tell me. Okay. He's gonna be like, you're gay. I'll be right back. Dude, just... Ah! Oh, God. Miss me? No. I've recently had a tragedy in my life. Alicia threw herself out of the window. Oh, boy. You can't make an omelette without breaking some eggs. So what, now you have an omelette? Another rooster in the hen house. <laughs> I love how he just brought his own music for this moment. Let me tell you about this guy I know, Jack. And then he had a... Now you want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. Yeah, don't go with a stick against a gun. You ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? What? I just like the sound of it. <laughs> Never rub another man's rhubarb. <laughs> oh God, what does that even mean? <laughs> It sounds good though. Catchy. It says good, right? So now she thinks that he's passed out and then Batman can appear. Oh my god! What for toch? I think your friend Wayne is really screwed up. It's kind of sad that he doesn't have the opportunity to tell this to you, but that you already know. What do you suppose something like this does to a kid? Well, I don't think it's good. We simply cannot guarantee public safety. Joker here. Oh boy. Without the makeup, I feel like it looks even scarier than with the makeup. I can be theatrical, but one thing I am not is a killer. Uh, I love a good party. Everybody's gonna go out and go to the party. At midnight, I will dump 20 million in cash on the crowd. That's so smart because you're gonna get everybody out that way. Otherwise, I would have stayed the fuck home and I still think I would stay home. I have taken off my makeup. Let's see if you can take off yours. Wish he hadn't taken off his makeup. <laughs> Poor guy. Like when you see him reading that stuff, he immediately turns back into that little boy. Oh no, we're actually gonna see it. No. Oh. I was speaking to someone yesterday about this that since I've had Alexander, I'm suddenly scared of death, but not because of me, but to leave him behind and will people take care of him and what's gonna be of him without a mommy. And it's a very interesting feeling that I didn't really expect it. Oh no. See, like this is horrendous. You ever dance with the devil by the pale moon? Oh, what? Damn, that guy has a freaky smile and he's not even makeup. Oh, whoa, Alfred kind of made a call here. Why won't you let me in? You got it. Oh, that's sweet. I just gotta know, are we gonna try to love each other? Damn, like she's so straightforward. I'd never be talking like that. But he likes it. Yes, it's working. Yeah, this is a man with a mission. So if she wants to be with him, that will be a big part of it. I think she can handle it. Batman has arrived at the scene. Nice. You with your little stupid guns. Uh oh. oh, 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 oh. Okay. Uh, damn. Oh, oh, oh. How did he prepare all of this? Yeah, they probably just want the dollar dollar bill. It's so tragic because you know when people are struggling and oh. He said this 
this up in like a couple of days. It's quite impressive. And now comes the part where I relieve you, the little people, of the burden of your failed no. and useless lives. But as my plastic surgeon always said, if you gotta go, go with a smile. <laughs> oh no. In a sense, I was predicting a catastrophe, like lure them out and then hurt them all, but he already pressed it. So can we prevent this? Is it too late? He's going to kill everybody! Get in the car. No! Get no, in the car! No! Did she just say no? And then get in the car anyway? <laughs> oh. <sighs> Hold on tight! He deserved better. You could make a put the man where he belongs type of joke, but he deserves so much better. <laughs> oh. oh! My balloons. No! Oh no! Cry me a river. <laughs> Amazing. Be free, toxic balloons. He stole my balloons! He's so like having a tantrum. These Batman actors really need to overdo their mad look, right? The whole. Come on, you gruesome son of a bitch. Come to me. Language, clown. <laughs> Damn, that was embarrassing. Woo! No way! You what? Batman, come on, man! You had the big pew pew, and he only had a small pew pew, and still. Oh boy! I've got to get you to the church on time. Take me to church. Oh, I'd be on the staircase like I'm a diabetic. I need sugar. And he'd be like, no, bitch, it's a movie. Get up there. And I'd be like, I'm really like. Uh. <gasps> oh, boy. Okay. Oops. That was impressive, though, until it wasn't. That was just embarrassing. <laughs> I don't know what that guy did. Without you, I just wouldn't want to go on. <laughs> Whee! Man, it also must be hard to move in that suit, even though he doesn't make it look hard. Oh! Oh! Oh, bonk! Oh, we have a saying in Dutch, ooh, that's like being hit with the, and then you have a bell with the thing in the middle. What's it called in English, the thing in the middle? And so it's called like being hit by the, and then this, because you're like bonkers. Beauty and the beast. Of course, if anyone else calls you beast, I'll rip their lungs out. Okay. He's like, you're into me? <laughs> oh, I love Oh my god, kids look away! Have you ever danced with the devil in the pale moonlight? Oh. Ew. You killed my parents. <laughs> what are you talking about? He probably doesn't even remember. It's just a blip in his memory. You wouldn't hit a guy with glasses on, would you? What a maniac. Here, let me lend your hand. Yeah, I don't know if that just that. Oh man, like this view gives me. <gasps> yes, get him. Oops. Uh oh. Oh, me. I don't know about the physics of all of that. Oh my god. Oh, a lot of statues were hurt in the making of this film. 
I mean, it looks good considering the circumstances. Mm. Take care, Ali. It'll be fine. <laughs> but if the forces of evil should rise again, call. Oh, there we go. That's cool. Oh, she contains herself so well. I'd be like, <laughs> Mr. Wayne told me to tell you that he might be a little late. Something she'll have to live with. Oh, the, like I'm so afraid of heights. I even have trouble looking at this. That was a lot of fun and I feel like even with knowing already a little bit of it in terms of who is Batman, Bruce Wayne, Alfred, I feel like it stays such a good story to watch it again. And of course this was first, right? So like for me it's an again watch, but for others the things that I have watched before came after this. I have to say that if I could pick I think I would still pick the Nolan trilogy, but I'm so biased toward Christopher Nolan and the actors that were in those and Heath Ledger and I forgot the main character's name and I kind of have a crush on him, so I shouldn't. Come on. Anyway, I really enjoyed it. So I'm kind of curious if I want to continue this. Is there a journey? Is there a timeline? What to watch next? The one thing that I struggle with with this movie is that I've seen Jack Nicholson in so many things right now. That I had a hard time disconnecting him from joker i don't know if other people like do you understand what i mean sometimes i feel like actors and i feel like people like matt damon or tom hanks are so good at that and no matter what role you put them you forget that they are matt damon or tom hanks and i feel like with this one his smile is so typical him and his eyes are so typical him that I was constantly thinking, this is Jack Nicholson. And I have a hard time letting that go. And I kind of wish I could, but yeah, I couldn't. I think he was a good Joker, definitely, because yeah, his smile and stuff, I can definitely see why they cast him for that role. And I like this Bruce Wayne as well. I had fun watching this. I had a really good time. I wonder if there's more actors that I should recognize because I didn't feel that way with many. So let me know which ones I could recognize from other stuff that I've seen because I'm very curious discover i might have said an intro but sometimes i feel like i don't really have friends who watch a lot of movies and at work or something either so i'm kind of like depending on the comment section to learn a lot about these things and that's what i love doing this as well so if you like it make sure to like subscribe full reaction and edited version of this is available on patreon and everything gets posted on patreon earlier so if you want to watch something else already next you can find that over there i hope you enjoyed this reaction and i'll see you in the next one bye bye